friends in this video i'll be creating an app which will notify to the user whenever a some new message is received so to do this we'll start a new android studio project so give the name as ex10 click on next then again next next finally finish First we will do the designing part, so delete the default hello world, drag a new linear layout, okay. so first insert a large text, change the text to message, then insert a multi line text. then a button uh, change the text to notify okay. so once this button is cl clicked this message will be displayed at, as a notification in the notification bar so go to the text view go to the button and type android on click so we will give the function as notify so click anywhere inside go to the bubble symbol and click on create notify of view so this is the code view of the xml file here you have to create the notifications so before that so insert one more activity blank activity so go to the java folder right click your application folder then go to new activity and click on blank activity so give the name as result activity and click on finish so there is no need to do anything in this layout now you can come to the main activity dot java this file in the notify function so here we will start first we will create a intent so intent some intent equal to new intent of this comma result activity dot class so then we will create a pending intent pending intent so I'll name it set pending equal to pending intent dot get activity of this comma zero comma the name of the intent that is intent comma zero next we will create the notification so notification so noti equal to new notification dot builder of this then come to next line type set content title so give the title as new message then we have to set the content text so before that so we will get the text we will create a variable for edit text edit text e1 equal to edit text of find view by id of r dot id dot edit text so this is the name of the text box so in order to very to get verified come here to content dot xml sorry content main.xml double click this file 
sorry this component you will get edit text is the name so come back here okay next line dot set content text set content text off so here we have to set the text so e1 dot get text off dot to string off so this is the text which will be set in the notification then set small icon of r dot mipmap dot ic launcher so this is the default launcher icon which is available in the mipmap folder you can see it here then dot set content intent of pending dot build off so this finishes your notification then we have to create an object for the notification manager so notification manager manager equal to notification manager of get system service of notification service okay so then noti dot flags put the r symbol equal to notification dot flag auto cancel then manager dot notify of zero comma noti okay. so this finishes your notifications now you can run your app click on the green symbol so your app will start compiling Select Jenny Motion here and click on OK. So here's the message. Hi, welcome to notification. So you can some type some message here and click on notify. So you'll see here a small Android icon here. Now drag your notification can see that is the title displayed here and your message displayed here okay thank you for watching this video